And here's what's happening after days of deliberations. The jury in the bribery and corruption trial of John Doherty and Bobby Heenan say it needs more time to reach a verdict. This is Eyewitness News at 6, and we are streaming live on CBSN Philly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. I'm Jessica Cartalia. We'll have to wait until Monday at the earliest for a possible decision in this case. Court adjourned for the weekend a little more than an hour ago on the third day of deliberations. Jurors are scheduled to return at 9.30 Monday morning. Eyewitness News reporter Howard Monroe breaks down what happened inside the courtroom. Court has adjourned for the day. The jury still has some things to iron out. Now, a court official said that they had hoped to have a verdict today, but the jury, they still had some questions for the judge. Jurors wanted to know the definitions of honest services fraud and honest services wire fraud. Those are the two main components of the government's case. Bobby Heenan worked for John Doherty at Local 98 since the late 1990s. But after Heenan won his council seat in 2011, prosecutors argued that he wasn't acting in the best interest of voters, but rather of Doherty. That would be the honest services fraud charge because as a member of the city council, his vote should be independent. The wire fraud charge alleges that Doherty kept Heenan on the payroll at Local 98. As a bribe for votes and other actions on the city council. They also argued that Heenan was bribed with tickets to sporting events. During the trial, the defense team argued Doherty was doing what was best for his union members and Heenan was doing what was best for the city. And the judge ordered the jury back to court for deliberations Monday morning beginning at 9 30. In Center City, Howard Monroe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. And we will have continuing coverage as we await a verdict in this trial. When that does come down, we will have updates on air and on our streaming service, CBSN Philly, as well as CBSPhilly.com.